This state lawsuit accuses the defrocked Cardinal Theodore McCarrick of running a sex ring. All of it cloaked in papal power. The suit alleges McCarrick began molesting young altar servers and seminarians in 1969, and in the 1980s, he allegedly got plenty of help from other men of the cloth, some deceased and some credibly accused. And it is time for this truth to be known. The lawsuit details what a then 11-year-old unidentified boy says took place. The suit refers to him as Doe 14, and it alleges Father Anthony Nardino sexually abused the boy at church and the principal of Essex Catholic High School, the now deceased and brother Andrew Hewitt, did as well and groomed him and introduced him to McCarrick when the boy's family had financial trouble paying tuition. Brother Hewitt became the procurer. Allegedly for McCarrick and trips to McCarrick's Metuchen Diocese paid for beach house in Seagirt, where McCarrick assigned where the seminarians and the priests would sleep. And in the night, with the assistance of others, McCarrick would creep into this kid's bed and engage in criminal sexual assault of him. whispering, it is okay. The suit alleges the sexual abuse was known to the Vatican as Pope John Paul II and other popes were promoting McCarrick and to the Diocese of Newark and the Diocese of Metuchen. The Metuchen Diocese spokesperson says, our prayers are with all survivors of abuse today and always, and we stand with them in their journey toward healing and help. Our diocese renews our commitment to prevent these types of abuse from ever happening again. A spokesperson for the Newark Archdiocese says it would not comment on pending litigation and remains committed to transparency and working with law enforcement to bring closure. Last year, McCarrick told Slate Magazine, I'm not as bad as they paint me. I do not believe that I did the things they accused me of. McCarrick's response to multiple boys making similar complaints about him, I think that they were encouraged to do that. It's time for the truth to come out. It's time for Pope Francis to stop promises, stop the pledges, and come clean. The lawsuit seeks unspecified damages under a state law, making it easier to sue for abuse years ago. Two years ago, the state attorney general began investigating predatory priests and opened a hotline to take complaints. Attorneys for Doe 14 say they deposed McCarrick, but would not disclose what he said, and the deposition, they say, is sealed. Michael Hill, NJTV News. Thank you.